Go. August 26, 2014, Singapore. I have commissioned this video about Dr. Tian Tun Ong, veteran surgeon of Royal Asia Veterinary Surgery, as a present for him. I have known him for more than 20 years when he first came to Singapore to work for other vets and uh, over time we have, we have become good friends. So I'm making this video for his uh, new website and also to wish him well in his uh, driving practice in Yangon. I visited him recently and uh, there were so many cases which are not seen in Singapore. This is because uh, many owners have come to see him for complicated cases which require surgery as apparently most vets in Yangon, in my observation, do not do surgery. And uh, for example, even uh, spaying of the dog and cats, that's because the culture was to give birth control injections uh, in the past. And so uh, the vets do not appear to uh, do much surgery, but this is a pre preliminary observation, I may be wrong. Then uh, the other reason could be the lack of anesthetic, gaseous anesthetic machines, as it is expensive. Now the problem with uh, investing in anesthetic machines is that if you don't have cases, the machine is not used, and so you can't, uh, you can't uh, amortize it, and so that may be the reason that uh, the best use injectable anesthetics. Now, in injectable anesthetics are not safe for long surgeries, and uh, that could be the reason that uh, complicated surgeries like fractures of bones are not done. So, Dr. Ong, being uh, experienced in Singapore, having worked with several vet clinics, has uh, acquired considerable skill and expertise in veterinary surgery, and he also likes veterinary surgery. He can spend hours talking about veterinary surgery and cases he has done. So I find him to be uh, very passionate about veterinary medicine and surgery. Very focused and driven as he works long hours. Uh, he's one of those rare vets who really are excellent vets who takes veteran medicine as a calling rather than as a means to make money. So I wish him well in his future.